let's hit small intestine meridian. Now, the easiest way for me to remember small intestine meridian is to know that it follows the line that I call the karate chop line. <laughs> <laughs> that used to be the main move for James Bond, didn't it? They don't do karate chops anymore <laughs> in the movies. So, we want to follow right along the edge. Now remember, all these meridians that are on the side follow along the junction of the red and white skin. So follow along the edge. Now, as you get closer to your elbow, you're going to go back because you need to get between the radius and the ulna. See these two bones right here? Small intestine eight, which is the earth point for small intestine, is between these two bones. It's like if you whack yourself, that's where it hurts the funny bone, like ouch, yeah. Okay, that's small intestine. Small intestine then goes up the very much the back side of your upper arm. Now our next trajectory is going to go to the armpit crease. So you want to go right up the back until you hit the crease right here. Stop. Where we're going to go from here is we're going to go straight up until we hit the bone. Stop underneath the ridge of the bone. Now you're going to drop down onto the scapula. And now you're going to go up to the medial border the top ledge of the scapula. It's like a little shelf. They call those shelves fossas, F-O-S-S-A, fossa. So this is the medial fossa on the top border of the scapula. Now, small intestine has two points, 14 and 15, that go a little bit more medial right next to the first thoracic vertebrae, and now you're going to go, your next trajectory line is to go to this point that's right behind your jawbone right there. So now here's my jaw, the point is right on my neck, underneath that, that angle of the jaw. So I'm going to go right like this and hit underneath my jaw from here. Now, Going underneath your cheekbone doesn't mean to go to the front of the cheekbone because that's stomach meridian. So it's the lateral angle. So it's over here. So now I'm going to go from underneath my jaw, underneath that angle of my cheekbone. And then I'm going to go over to the flap, this flap right here of my ear. And that's where small intestine meridian goes. So let's take it on the other side. You can probably now put your intention into this line because we've done a lot of mechanical things. Let's take our time as we go up the karate chop line to the funny bone point. Your next trajectory is to go up the back of the arm right up to the crease. And now we're going to draw our fingers up until we hit the bone at the top of the scalp. We're going to drop down onto the body of the scapula. We're going to bring our fingers up to the medial border on the fossa of the scapula. From here, we're going to go over to the angle of the jaw. And now underneath the lateral angle of the cheekbone and finish at the opening of the 